Disturbing and alarming cell phone video captures the moment a nine-year-old girl is beaten by several older boys while riding on a bus from Coconut Palm K-8 Academy in Homestead. Emotionally, I couldn't even last two minutes. I couldn't look at the video. Like any mother, I am destroyed. I fell to my knees and at that moment I said I have to do something, said Jenny, who is the mother of the young girl who was attacked. Jenny says her daughter was attacked while riding on the school bus Wednesday afternoon. Her 10-year-old son was also pummeled on the same bus ride. Another kid came out of nowhere and hit my son and he fell to his knees, and they started to hit him, said Jenny. Jenny says her kids have only been enrolled in the school for three weeks. She reached out to CBS 4 Wednesday to report bullying at the school, only for these incidents involving her children to happen hours later. But Jenny isn't the only parent claiming there's serious issues at Coconut Palm K-8 Academy. My son was bullied at that school, since the beginning of the school year, said a mother who wished to remain anonymous. This mother says her son, who's in the third grade, was repeatedly physically bullied by his peers. She tells us she reached out to the school several times, messaging teachers and administrators, only to be ignored or not answered for weeks. There was an incident during PE and she said that what happens in PE stays in PE and that to me was just bewildering. Things got so bad for this student, that his mother says she did the only thing she could do to protect him. I had to pull my kid out of the school, cause that school doesn't care about their children. Following the viral videos of the two students being beaten on the bus, Miami-Dade County Public Schools released a statement that reads in part. Miami-Dade Schools Police arrested the offender and they will be charged accordingly. Additionally, those involved will be disciplined according to the Code of Student Conduct. The mother of the two children who were attacked on the bus tells CBS 4 a 14-year-old was arrested and that she plans to press charges. She also says physically, her kids are okay, but says they're traumatized by what happened. Disturbing videos of a school bus beating shows two children, who are brother and sister, being pounded by their peers, prompting the victim's mother to take action. The student's parents met with Seven News and said they have tried for weeks to get help for their children, who attend Coconut Palm K-8 Academy, located at 24400 Southwest 124th Avenue. In South Miami-Dade. In the bus riding beating, the nine-year-old girl can be seen bent down in her seat as a teen stood over her and delivered a barrage of blows. Another video showed her 10-year-old brother being beaten while on the same bus. The little girl was left with scratches and bruises, and her parents are now left figuring out why this happened to their children. This kid is just beating my daughter senseless for no reason. She can't defend herself, said the children's father. She's a little girl. How is this acceptable? The girl suffered bruises on her head, back and shoulders, leaving her parents fuming and full of questions about how this could have happened to their children. At the same time that my daughter was getting beaten, the same thing was happening to my son on the other side of the bus, said the victim's father. Both videos have since made the rounds on social media. The clips were recorded Wednesday on a school bus carrying students from Coconut Palm Academy. The parents of the children, who asked to remain anonymous, said this isn't the first time their daughter and son have been targeted. They said they've been bullied at this school since they started in January. Ever since then, I've been to the school, and I've spoken with counselors, principals, assistant principals, said the children's mother. An assistant principal wrote us, and she said, Oh, I think it's time you take your kids out of the school, and our kids aren't the problem, said the children's father. They love to learn, and it's just so sad that something that they enjoy is becoming something they're fearing now, said the children's mother. Since the incident, these parents have pulled their children out of Coconut Palm Academy. They're taking their nine-year-old to a doctor and may take legal action after that. How many times do we have to come to an assistant principal, principal or counselor within the school for someone to actually step up and say, we're going to make these changes? Said the children's mother. I'd understand if it's a one-time issue, whatever, but we've been calling their attention since day one, said the children's father. Since day one we've been calling their attention, and they've done jack. One student has been arrested while others were disciplined. Miami-Dade County Public Schools released the following statement, The safety and well-being of our students is of the utmost importance. The school district goes to great lengths to promote values of restraint and respect, as well as using social media responsibly. We ask that parents reinforce those principles at home. 
the children's parents said they may be homeschooling their children, for now, to keep them safe. As of Friday afternoon, the Miami-Dade public school system is now reviewing the incident to see if the bus driver should face any disciplinary action. 7 News asked Miami-Dade Public Schools if the superintendent would answer questions about the bullying issue at the school but has yet to comment. Disturbing video of a young girl's assault on a school bus has gone viral, angering parents and inundating a South Florida school district with demands that someone be held accountable. In the cell phone video, a student from Coconut Palm K-8 Academy in Homestead is seen pummeling a 9-year-old girl's head with his fists repeatedly as she tries to fend him off. He stops for a moment, and another boy quickly jumps in to take his place amid the shouts of onlooking classmates.